I love you, Jenny. I can't believe it's been a year since. And well, I'm still here. And I have all of you to thank. I see some new faces. And although it's never good things that bring us here, it's good that we are here, here to share our strength, and help each other find a better way. I really like what you said in, inside there. Thanks. You come here for long enough, you'll start sounding like that too. You're new here, right? Yes. Here's my number. Call me anytime if you need to talk. Or... Seriously. So what brought you to the group? He had the most heavenly blue eyes, like those you'd imagine behind the eyelids of angels. Matthew. Jenny. Jenny. He was young, but he knew what he wanted. I loved him. He provided me with strength, and I was his savior. Oh, fuck me in the freezer. <laughs> what are you looking at? Shut up! Two packs, right? Two gallons. No smoking at the pump. You hear me, girl? Hey, you hear me? Got it. Nice hair. No smoking! He came to see me years later. He changed. I just sat there and smiled and nodded while inside my soul screamed to touch him, to taste him. He talked about his life, about how he had married his high school sweetheart. I knew that had been a mistake. Another? I'm good. That'll be 25. What's with the tank? Cleansing. Keep the change. You sure? Hey. You okay? Now that's a tip. Drink your piss. It's on the house. 
course. So what brought you to the group? Same thing as you, I imagine. <laughs> well, I just wanted to tell my story to someone who would actually listen. So you haven't tried um, it yet? You don't have to. That's what this group is all about. That's why we're all here, to listen. Nothing is that bad. Why do you think you have to kill yourself? I have done something reprehensible. I am going to burn. Have you ever lost someone you loved? I was hurt really bad. I lost him, my husband. No warning signs, nothing. Just there one day and gone the next. He didn't tell me he loved me on a videotape, that was it. And for weeks I kept rewinding it over and over hoping to find some reason why he hated me so much, why he hated us, our life. But there was nothing. Just, I love you, and static. You're still looking for a reason. I've stopped looking for a reason. Now it's just something I have to do. And have you learned anything? Sure. We all live double lives. Some are just more caustic to the ones we love than others. Thank you uh, for meeting me. No problem. Want to have a seat? read the Bible, but do I believe in heaven and hell? Jesus on water and knocked up virgins and fairy tales? No. <laughs> Time passes. The older we get, the more our natural faith becomes. People change. Some for the best. Most Sadly, for the worst. Growing old is a bitch, so they say. <laughs> uh, may I have one of your cigarettes? Sure. Black golds. That was his brand. <clears throat> My angels. He had to know. I was the only one who could love him the way he deserved to be loved. More than that high school sweetheart ever could. He should have stayed with me. But he never did have the courage to finish what he started. My little Maddie. All grown up. A real man. He had the most heavenly blue eyes. Like those you'd imagine. 
watching behind the eyelids of angels. The last thing he said to me was, Do you believe in destiny, Father? <laughs> I never believed in fate. Coincidence, yeah, but never fate. Sometimes all you need to change your perspective is one lucky strike. I was never a smoker until that day. After the police took him, I found the rest of his pack wedged in the couch. I know it's silly, but every time I inhaled, I could taste our pain together. Like I was kissing the past. Kissing me. Jealous bastard, this witch that he loved me, not you. He loved me. Are you ready, Father? I am weak. For Satan, be not. Be not far from me. Make haste, to Help your shepherd. Help your shepherd. You are my salvation. Goodbye, Father. Ah! 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 Ah!